Listen, let me let me do this. Let me do this. Yeah, I'm about to start right now. I don't know if y'all saw this this mouthpiece that I had made. This mouthpiece says man down. And uh when we started this journey for this fight, I knew something special was gonna happen tonight. Obviously, the result wasn't the result that we wanted, but this is how serious I was about this fight. I don't think Errol Spence has ever been in the ring with anyone as serious as I am and was about this fight. Taking nothing from him at all. He came here and he did his thing. He fought back, he fought hard. But I just want y'all to know, a lot of people out there say he was the boogeyman. A lot of people out there said I couldn't take his punches. He was too big. Uh, he was too long. And the list goes on from there. This mouthpiece right here is a reflection of everything y'all saw tonight. A reflection of heart, a reflection of will, a reflection of skill, love, the whole nine. So what y'all saw tonight, y'all, everybody's saying it's an instant classic. you are saying it's the fight of the year, so on and so forth. The man down was coming for the man down. We put on a fantastic performance tonight. I, I, I'll thank him again and again and again. He did a fantastic job. But I just want y'all to know that ain't nobody ever going to go at him the way I went at him. Right. And y'all just saw it. Y'all can go ahead with y'all questions. Sean over here. Congratulations on a great performance. Uh, after after the fight, you nodded your head in approval. You were displeased. Uh, you landed the most shots on Errol Spence that anyone has in his entire career. Did you feel that you won that fight? I mean... <laughs> <laughs> Listen, um, I'm going to be myself, and myself says, you know, when I, when I don't win, I can't hang my head. When I don't win, um, I can't make excuses. Uh, this was a fantastic fight tonight. Um, you know, I have to, definitely have to take a look back. I, I felt comfortable a majority of the rounds. Um, really, the, the one round I didn't feel comfortable in, obviously, was the round my hand touched the, the canvas. But other than that, I felt very comfortable through this fight. Uh, I tried to sh stay poised and, you know, stay within whatever my corner was asking me to do, make the necessary adjustments, so on and so forth. So for me to say that was a robbery, you're not going to hear me say it. Sorry. Uh, my dad can say it. Barry can say it. Everybody else can say it. But that ain't going to come from me.